And again, ooh. oh my God, this smells so good. Oh, this smells. Hey, my skin is so soft. My skin is soft. This is top tier, baby. Top tier. Hey y'all, my name is Melissa Denise and welcome back to my channel you guys. Okay, so instead of a vlog, we're doing something a little bit different today. We are going to unbox a Joe Malone order. So I want to tell you a little bit about my order um, before we actually unbox it, okay? So um, I was actually going through my emails and I seen a offer from American Express to say if you spend $120 or more, you get $20 off. I said, okay, well, let's look. Let's go look because I did want to do a East St. Laurent um, purchase when they had like the, I think it was buy one, get one free sale. And I seen it and it was my biggest mistake. I seen it. I said, you know what? I'm going to just um, go back and like tomorrow and look. I should have did everything right then and there because the next time I would dig go and look, what I wanted was gone. was out of stock. Regardless of the yeah. fact, I'm so glad I got me a Joe Malone order. <laughs> so um, to be quite honest, this is my very first Joe Malone um, purchase. I have been eyeing them for quite some time. I've added stuff to the car and took it out or just let it go. But I couldn't pass up the deal that they had when I went to go look. So, like I said, American Express is offering me $20 off everything that's over $120 or more. So, let me show you guys what I bought. Well, I'm going to tell you what I bought. So, I bought the 50 milliliter, which is um about 1.9 ounces, if I'm not mistaken. Hold on, let's double check. is 1.69 so almost 1.7 um ounces which is a really good size bottle um and that was 110 and then at the time they had a bath and body duo so it's like full size but um full two two full size products but you get them for free and it was And the body cream, I believe, came in 50 milliliters. And then the wash, the um, hand and body wash, came in 100 milliliter. And 100 milliliter, y'all, sorry, to ounces, just in case you guys want to know, is 3.38 ounces. So, and with that, <clears throat> and so that was, so the $110 bottle, then I knew I was getting the two, the Bath and Body Duo, right? And so it's 110. Of course, y'all, I have to spend 120. So I end up getting it um, engraved with my name. And if you don't know, then they do free shipping and complimentary gift wrap. I think it's I think it's over 125 dollars, but I think they um, changed that up. But I'm not quite sure. So don't um, don't hold me to that. So with that, I also got two samples. And because I knew I was get the Peony and Blush Suede Cologne, I mean, I'm sorry, body cream, I also got the sample of the cologne because I wasn't sure if I was gonna like it, but we're about to find out and see. And then I also got the English Pear and Freesia. I hope that's how you say it, um, cologne. So let's go ahead and open this box and see how everything came out. I'm super excited. Y'all, I am super duper excited to open this. Like, I cannot wait to see what this looks like, what it smells like. Because, y'all, this is a total blind purchase. Oh, but let me, let me, before we get to that, um, let me sure I clear off all my stuff that's up here. So... If y'all can see it, I spent $131 and 
cents, $131.34. And that was the whole entire purchase with um with this with the free products. And so I will see a $20 credit with my Amex card. Well, I think they do within four weeks. So spent only a hundred and one dollars on this technically. So let's open this up. And you know, that's a good save. That's a very good save, especially for John. Martin. Okay. Very first thing we see are the samples, the peony and blush suede cologne. And the English pear and freesia. I hope that's right, y'all. Freesia cologne. And I, I'm trying to, you know what? I'm going to smell it. Let's see. Give me one second, y'all. So I'm going to use um, some paper towels just to kind of get the smell of it without spraying it on myself because I don't want to waste. Um, I don't want to blend anything because I'm definitely going to put on this um, sea sage. I'm sorry. I'm definitely going to uh, wear the wood sage and sea salt for sure, but I don't want to put both on. So I'm going to just spray it. On the paper towel, see what happens. See what it smells like. Get an idea. Because, you know, everyone's chemistry, body chemistry is different. So, just because you spray on this, and just because you spray it on this doesn't mean that's what it smells like on you. It just gives you an idea of it. So, and, you know, even when they do, like, little samples at the store, I hate that. I rather just smell from the bottle. Okay. And, again, ooh, oh, my God. <laughs> this smells so good. So again, yeah, I just sprayed the English Pear and Freesia Cologne. And on inside, it does tell you, ooh, what's in it? So, it's the essence of autumn, mellow, cool, and golden. Baby, it is. And it is. Um, the fruity, the top is King William Pear, Freesia, hope I'm saying that right, and base patchouli um and then it says try lane with wild blueberry for a fresher scent velvet rose and oud for a warmer scent mm. and i wanted the wild blueberry sample but it was out of stock but baby hoo, hoo, hoo. This is, that smells beautiful okay beautiful so our next sample Yeah, our next sample is Peony and Blush Suede. And it, remember, I did get this in the um, body cream as well. So let's see what it smells like. I like it. It's soft. Um, yes, it's, it's very soft. So, and it's, it's sexy. It's like, it's soft and sexy. And I like that. Yes, yeah, soft and sexy. So, it says, um, Peonies and voluptuous bloom, exquisitely fragile, luxurious, opulent, and flirtatious. The top note is red apple. The heart is peony and the base is suede. Try laying with orange blossom for a fresher scent. Wood sage and sea salt for a warmer scent. Ha <laughs> ha! Yes, we are. Yes, we are. I feel like you could do a lot of warmer scents in the fall and winter. And baby, it's right on time. So just the fact that I do like this, it it reminds me of something, but I just can't put a name to it. It definitely reminds me of a, another scent. But I can't wait. So let's continue, y'all. Let's continue. Okay, so we get into the ooh, into the the freebie full size, not no sample size booth. 
<laughs> so we have the peony blush and suede um body cream oh it's velvety oh snap i don't want to do that what did say to for you to layer it so i think we are <laughs> I think we are y'all we're gonna go ahead and layer it since i kind of dropped a little bit on my hands but i am going to smell it without it's velvety y'all let me try to move some of this up away like let me show y'all what i seen when i opened it like look at that like that's so velvety that's oh that's nice and it smells exactly like the perfume exactly like it exactly so ooh, yes then we have the wood sage and sea salt body and hand wash of course my hands are a little <laughs> So now we have the wood sage and sea salt body hand and wash gel. Mm, it smells so good, y'all. Look at that. Ooh. And I like the bottle as well. It has like, like the text. I love the textured bottle. That's really nice. And I do want to give you the deets on that let's see if we can find it real quick y'all okay so i'm gonna read what it says online for the wood sage and sea salt cologne or just the fragrance itself it says escape the everyday along the windswept shore waves breaking white the air fresh with sea salt and spray alive with the mineral scent of the rugged cliffs mingling with the woody earthiness of sage lively spirited and totally joyful okay okay with the description so the top note is ambrite seeds um the heart note is sea salt and the base note is sage so they kind of they just they name it pretty accurately so that's really good um for a fresher scent you should layer it with english oak and hazelnut cologne and then it said for a warmer scent, it had Miratonka. And that is next up on my list. That's next up. But let's look at this engraved bottle, y'all. Look how pretty the packaging. Oh, y'all, the packaging. So, so pretty. It feels luxy. The box is not cheap at all. At all. It better not be for the price. You know what I'm saying? So, <gasps> y'all, look at this. Oh, and y'all see, you got engraved with my name. I love, I love, I love. Yes. So, for the sake of not layering immediately, I'm going to spray on the other end. Yeah, on the other end of the paper towel. very earthy very. when it starts to settle that's the best so I'm gonna go ahead and layer y'all yes you can definitely smell the ambrite seeds and the sage for sure for sure y'all this is my new favorite my new favorite yes so would i recommend joe malone yeah yes most definitely <laughs> i definitely recommend joe malone um especially the wood sage and sea salt um that's really nice the 
peony and blush suede this was a nice surprise um again this was a blind purchase i didn't know what anything smelled like um smelled like i have not been to a store i've just seen a lot of people rant and rave about it and the reviews are accurate it smells wonderful ever since that i received or that i purchased smells good um now will i purchase full size in the peony blush and blush suede um let me smell one more game before i tell y'all the result yes i would i would <laughs> i definitely would um and i i would I, no lie i will buy a full size for sure because it smells like it could be a good um, fragrance to layer with. Like it, whatever that it, it layers with or combines with, it will make it seem fresher. And I like that. So I can understand why they would want to put um, Penny and Wood Sage Sea Salt together. They did say for a warmer scent and most definitely. It just gives you like that burst of um, freshness. When you want to put it with this even the body even with the body cream with the perfume i mean yeah with the wood sage and sea salt is it sea salt yeah wood sage and sea salt it smells good but i will say i smell this more than i do this and that's probably because this is just it was just a little bit like i did but of course you don't need much you don't need much y'all um Compared to that, I didn't put nothing on um, before, and that to put on that body cream, baby, my skin is so soft. My skin is soft. I love it. Um, I feel like I have soft skin anyway because I do a very good skin regimen, but this is this is top tier, baby, top tier. <laughs> um. Now the English Care and Freesia, yes, most definitely. As soon as I wave the paper towel in front of me, this is it. I would definitely um, get this as well. Matter of fact, let me see what to pair it with. Um, It says to for a fresher scent with the English pear and freesia. I probably should look up how to correctly say that. I hope I'm saying it correctly. Um, orange blossom to make it fresher and then to make it warmer with sage and sea salt. So I'm going to try that combination as well. Um, I think I'm more of the warmer um tone or the, the warmer scent kind of girl especially now that it's fall and um in winter time um during the summertime <laughs> um so i hope i'm still in frame so i'm gonna back up just a little bit um yeah during the summertime as you do dolce and gabbana light blue and it kind of pairs with every, a lot of different things um but am i happy with my purchase yes will i purchase again hell yes <laughs> i told you what is next up on my list but i think i'm going to also go for english the english pear um cologne because that is bomb too like i didn't think i was gonna like that because i was really trying to go for the blueberry or the wildberry one um but they didn't have it um and that makes me think it's very popular so I'm gonna go back. So I have three on my list: Maritanka, English Pear, and Freesia, and and Freesia, and then also um, the Blueberry one. Let me make sure and tell y'all the name. So if y'all interested in it, y'all will know. And also, if you already have it, let me know how you like it. What do you pair it with? Um, let's see. Blackberry and Bay Cologne. That's what it was. Blackberry and Bay Cologne. Okay. 
okay y'all i had to put in a new sd card <laughs> um so i hope i'm still in frame so i'm gonna back up just a little bit um yeah during the summertime as you do dolce and gabbana light blue and it kind of pairs with every, a lot of different things um but am i happy with my purchase yes will i purchase again hell yes <laughs> without a doubt um like i said the next fragrance on my list is um Muratan. i got far okay so i've already told you what is next up on my list but i think i'm going to also go for english the english pair um cologne because that is bomb too like i didn't think i was gonna like that because i was really trying to go for the blueberry or the wildberry one um but they didn't have it um and that makes me think it's very popular so i'm gonna go back so i have three on my list Muratanka, english pear and freesia and and freesia and then also um the blueberry one let me make sure let me tell y'all the name so if y'all interested in it y'all will know and also if you already have it let me know how you like it what do you pair it with um let's see blackberry and bay cologne that's what it was blackberry and bay cologne so most definitely um those will be my next three purchases but i'm forever grateful for having an american express card because this cologne by itself is 110 right so we talking about we got this for 60 we got these two items that's normally 63 dollars together for free with a 100 milliliter wood sage and sea salt for 120 with the engraved so with samples because they know they go they they go have me back you know i'm coming back so to say we only spent 110 dollars not bad at all not even a little bit we that's damn near half that's damn near half y'all 183 dollars and then you have your samples so you may want to say for the brand itself you know they may do of course they got free samples but you can get like another sample for what 10 15 dollars in other brands about the same size that's half and you cannot beat it at all so yes you should get joe malone if you haven't tried it please <laughs> tell me what you think about these fragrances tell me um what is your favorite and what do you pair it with because as my first experience with Joe Malone and doing a unboxing with you guys and not having I mean not having smelled not one fragrance or cologne or body wash anything, I am a hundred percent happy. A hundred percent. So I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope everything that I've said was helpful. Um and that you can go purchase from Joe Malone as well. And I will see y'all next time. Bye. Oh, wait, and, uh, oh,